Hi, my name is Jen Ashton. I live in North Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, and I'm an artist and an author. I was born in Burnaby, BC, and when I was a kid, uh, we moved over to North Vancouver. I come from a really hardworking family who are super creative and very athletic and I'm sure that's where I got my creativity from. When I was a really little kid I knew that I wanted to be a writer and I always I can always remember writing. Uh, now I've written a few books and I've been in journals and newspapers and magazines and it's still my number one thing. When I was 15 years old, I left school to do something a little bit different for a while, uh, and I got back to school in the 90s, and I went to school for a long time. Hey look, some of my favorite things. During the 90s, I worked, volunteered, and taught at the university. I worked a lot. I think I may have tried to paint, but I wasn't ready yet. I'm pretty sure my other voice was too tired to speak. And then, in the early 2000s, Chris and I opened a recording studio. We've worked with over 100 artists locally and overseas. We had some amazing times. We made lots of CDs. We still do it, just not quite as much. We worked with lots of awesome people. Uh, we've also raised a ton of money for charity, and you can often find me doing silly things to raise money for charity, and feel free to join in. In my spare time, I love to code and make video games that are super appropriate for all ages. About two and a half years ago, I decided that I was going to do something cool uh, that I've always wanted to do and that was learn how to paint. So I signed up for a six week online painting class. That's where I learned how to paint my life and I've been doing it ever since. In the last oh, two and a half years, I guess I've painted nearly a thousand paintings or maybe just over I'm not sure um, I love everything about it I love trying new techniques and new supplies and it's a whole big wide open world to me um, I'm still learning and it's amazing I find inspiration everywhere uh, in our little house that we call the cabin it's just inspiration I look outside my window and it's everywhere it's all around me um, and if I ever get stuck, there's always myself. And just like in writing, um, work with what you know. And that seems to work okay. And our dogs, who are super special to us, uh, you'll find them in a lot of my work too. <laughs> Aside from being really colorful, people say my work is whimsical, and I guess it is. I don't really go into a painting with a plan. I chuck paint around until I see something and then I make it happen. Uh, as close as I get to painting something that I see is when I paint from memory. I've just started doing it recently and it's a lot of fun. Um, yeah. I just kind of uh, see something and then start filling it in or blocking it out and it becomes what it is. And I often like to try new techniques and n new colors even will make me uh, paint differently and new substrates. It's awesome. I just love it. Just putting color on paper. It's amazing. The joy that I get from that. And I even won an award, which was kind of one of those little goodies that's along the path that makes you kind of know that you're doing the right thing. And I even caught the attention of these awesome and creative people, which was pretty amazing. <laughs> the top two questions that people ask me are, how did I make all of this happen so quickly and how did I find my style? There are no easy answers in finding your other voice, but for me, understanding that my art is just another form of creative communication which helps me connect with people really set the stage. In fact, finding my voice didn't really have much to do with painting at all. First, I defined my version of success, which was to find the joy in whatever I do. Next, I found my style through pure non-judgment and self-acceptance. 
I didn't judge my work, I didn't compare it to other people, and I didn't set unreasonable goals for myself. I just let it happen. It was then that my true nature and other voice was revealed. Thanks for watching. Come and visit my website and join the fun.